Coutinho shines as 10-man Aston Villa and Leeds fight out thrilling draw. Diego Llorente earned Leeds a battling point in a breathless 3-3 draw at Aston Villa. The defender struck in the second half as the visitors hit back from 3-1 down. Felipe Coutinho pulled the strings in a whirlwind first half, where he cancelled out Dan James' opener before twice setting up Jacob Ramsey. James made it 3-2 before the break and Lorente ensured a pulsating game at Villa Park ended even. Esri Kansa was also dismissed late on for a second yellow card for Villa, but Leeds were unable to capitalize. The draw edged Marcelo Bielsa's side, now with just three wins in their last 12 games, six points clear of the relegation zone and denied Villa a place in the Premier League's top 10. But Villa began brightly enough with Ilan Messlier ensuring Lorente did not turn Douglas Lewis's corner into his own net. Yet the hosts faded quickly, allowing Leeds to grab the initiative and a ninth-minute lead. Tyrone Mings twice failed to deal with the ball on the right, with a weak first challenge on Mattis Click allowing Lorente to steal the ball from him on the edge of the area. He found James and the winger stepped inside Kansa to drill in low across Emi Martinez. The goalkeeper then stopped a fizzing James effort, while Lucas Dean needed to be alert to clear ahead of Rafinha with Villa on the rocks. Ming should have leveled, but headed Douglas Lewis's corner wide, and the entertainment continued when Jack Harrison's quick break teed up James only for his rising 20-yard drive to clatter the bar. There was purpose and pace from the visitors, while Coutinho had been anonymous until he leveled things after half an hour and tore Leeds apart in a devastating spell. Matty Cash was the architect, latching onto Emi Buendia's pass and crossing for the unmarked Brazilian. Leeds inexplicably stood off the Barcelona low knee, and he was allowed to steer the ball low into the corner for a second goal in three games. Eight minutes later Coutinho turned provider with a sumptuous assist. He turned Luke Ayling and split the Leeds defence with the perfect pass for the Andrishing Ramsey to advance and drill past Messlier. It was reminiscent of the link-up Steven Gerrard and Coutinho enjoyed at Liverpool, and the relationship continued to blossom when Ramsey made it 3-1 six minutes later. Coutinho was in the mood and led the charge when referee Jar Gillette played advantage after Dean was polyaxed. Ollie Watkins' clever run took two defenders with him, and Ramsey was left alone to collect Coutinho's pass and find the top corner. A flat-out first half then concluded when James made it 3-2 just before the break, heading in from point-blank range after Rodrigo's cross ballooned off Kansa. Perhaps unsurprisingly the level dropped with neither side managing to make a concerted impression immediately after the break. But it was a brief lull as Leeds leveled just after the hour. Pascal Struge could seen a header cleared off the line from Mings, but Leeds regrouped, and from their next corner the Villa captain went from hero to villain. This time he failed to get enough on a clearance following Struge's header, and Lorente smashed in from eight yards. Villa had already lost Buendia to injury and needed to rediscover their composure, which continued to elude them when Kansa was